team will play tonight without one of its big stars, one of its truly own, a quarterback who was lost just three weeks ago in a car accident. Fox Force Sean McDowell talked to some Lewisburg players who say they plan to play tonight with their motivation being memory. In Lewisburg, Kansas, it used to seem as if nothing could be bigger than high school football, and then something even bigger happened. Of a vigil for his 17 year old nephew. That teenager was 17 year old Austin McClellan. Police reports from Saturday, August 17th say the Wildcats starting quarterback tried passing another car on this stretch of Metcalf Road in Miami County when he lost control and hit a utility pole. McClellan died at the hospital later that night, which was the evening before fall football practice would begin for Lewisburg High. And we were we were best friends. I mean, we we had a select few guys that we were you know we would all hang out and always we were always doing something. Just a friend had called me and told me, and I was just I was totally shocked, and it was it was unreal. Now the surviving Wildcats are carrying on, trying to get back to the business of a normal life and playing the game they love to honor their fallen friend. Put your hand on the ground. Let's go, offense. Come Wildcats on. coach Kyle Literal says he called his seniors together the morning after the accident, and all of them voted to play on because Austin would want them to. Well, nothing's ever going to be back to, to the same or normal where it was, but we can establish a new normal and move on from there. Players say it's been tough to move past the tragedy and they've had to grow up quickly in the aftermath. That's just kind of how football is. I mean, you're all one big family and you're, gonna, you're always gonna care for the person that's right, right across from you. The, these kids are resilient, They're, they bounce back. These Wildcats say they can't give up because even after his passing, Austin won't let them quit. Nine of these Wildcats would have been his teammate for one final season, and they say they still feel his push cheering them to fight on. Oh, he'd want us to go as hard as we could completely go, 100%, all the effort we can get, because that's, that's how he was, that's what he lived by. He would tell him, hey, you never know when your last play's coming, you better play everyone hard. And to keep moving forward in life, friends here and gone would want it that way. Sean McDowell, Fox 4 News, working for you in Lewisburg, Kansas.